Okay, so today is going to be an updated Bath & Body Works haul. You guys have requested this a ton. I will link my old one down below. It was when I had my Bath & Body Works stuff in my master bedroom and I had like the little Office Depot black and gray and white storage cart. So I've since had a whole makeup room, <laughs> which um, I will link my makeup room tour and my vanity tour down below um, along with the Bath & Body Works so that you guys can see it. And here's my jewelry armoire as well. I'll link that. Anything that has to do with the room, I'll link down below. But um, this is currently where I keep my Bath & Body Works stuff right now. So not all of it's Bath & Body Works. I actually have nail stuff in this top drawer or the first and the second drawer and then Bath & Body Works from there down. <laughs> so this uh, drawer I get asked about all the time. This is kind of like what you guys see in the back of my videos um, for the most part. I get asked about that all the time. Like I said, it's from Ikea. Um, it's the Alex 9 drawer storage and I absolutely love this. I first saw it from saw it from Amerix and then I've seen it for a bunch of different people since then. Um, I absolutely love it. So on top, just briefly, I don't really have too much. I have this mirror from Walmart. Um, the Sarah Jessica Parker perfume, a Hello Kitty bank, this like little tub sitting on two candlestick holders that I got from Dollar the Dollar Tree. I got that from Bath and Body Works with all my Lush goodies. I plan on putting all of my um, old perfume bottles here, like all of my empty ones. I just haven't really done it yet. So, like I said, the first two drawers here are going to be nail stuff. This is like. Uh, taking care of my nails, base coats, top coats, and then here is like nail art and stuff like that. And I go through this in my um, room tour, so you can see that there. And then this third drawer, I have body splashes. So I actually have another Victoria's Secret. This is not all Bath and Body Works, but it's. I'm just going to show you guys anyway. I actually have another incredible Victoria's Secrets, the blue one that's over in my bedroom. This is the. I don't know, pink one. I have Victoria's Secret Love Spell. I have pink with a splash, um, soft and dreamy, warm and cozy. This is sunny and happy and pretty and pure. These are just the little mini bottles here. And actually these you can get from Bath & Body Works or Victoria's Secret because I found out on one of my videos that Victoria's Secret actually owns Bath & Body Works or the other way around and I didn't know that for a long time. Um, I have this Beauty Rush in Candy Baby. It's like the two-tone one. This one actually is from Victoria's Secret. Um, this is Give a Little Pink Body Mist in Snowy Violet Apple Blossom. I got this on clearance a while back. Um, I, want, I can't remember if I got this from Bath & Body Works or Victoria's Secret. And then I have these two Aloha Pinks that or again, either from Bath & Body Works or Victoria's Secret. This is Wild and Breezy, and this one is Vibrant and Beachy. Um, and I absolutely love these because they remind me of Hawaii. So, yeah, this is just not really the best way to keep your body splashes, but it works for me. The next drawer is more body splashes. <laughs> surprise, surprise. I have um, back here Sweet Pea. Um, what is this one? A sea Island Cotton, which is um, one of my favorite scents for like clean. <laughs> this is uh, Pink Chiffon in the New Mist. Really love that one as well. I have Carried Away, Be Enchanted, Paris Amour, Secret Wonderland, Cherry Blossom, or Japanese Cherry Blossom, and then the Signatures Vanilla and Coconut in the Mini. I also have a couple more in my um, car. I have a Mini Carried Away. I have the Twilight Woods in my car. And I also have a tiny Sea Island cotton or a travel size. So that's pretty much all my body sprays. I try and dwindle them down as you guys can see in my um, blog sales. I try and dwindle them down as best I can. If I'm not using a scent or I feel like I have too much of it, um, meaning if I have duplicates and things like that, I try and get rid of them. I try not to hold on to them because as you can see, I have a ton. I probably This will probably be good for the rest of my life. Okay, this next drawer is all of my antibacterial stuff and all of my like home scent things that aren't candles and bulbs. So over here I have a very wide variety of these handy backs. I have all kinds. I mean literally from probably some from Halloween, from Christmas. I have um, from various collections. Uh, these I rotate them out so that they never expire and I also refill my large hand sanitizers with these and I have one at work I have one in our bathroom and one downstairs so I constantly am rotating these out because I tend to purchase them quite often 
I probably have way too many at this point, um, but you know, hey, what can I say? I love Bath and Body Works. And then back here, I have two of these handy back little things to hold them, which I still have. I mean, I have a ton of already. Like I said, I have some in my car. <laughs> I have some in my purse. These right here are the oil, the oil um, warmers. I have a bunch of these around the house. I don't use these as often as much as I burn candles. I don't know why. And again, I have various scents. I usually try and buy them when they're on sale, like when you can get them for $4. Um, I have a bunch of pineapple orchids. I have some, you can kind of see better from over here, some twilight wood, some sweet pea. I have a couple of leaves ones. Um, what is this? Black amethyst, vanilla coconut, mint chocolate, Japanese cherry blossom. So I just have a bunch of them here. And then back here, I have one of those little things that go in your car that take the scent portables. So I have a Caribbean Escape and a Lavender Vanilla. I actually need to get a few more of those because I always keep one in my car and so does on the dress. Here I have two of the um, pocket backs. These are the Spray uh, Fresh Market Apple and Sweet Pea. I haven't used those yet, but I actually need to because I really like these much better than I, I like the alcohol ones. I have a few scent bugs, so I have some scent, scent bug refill packs. Over here, I have um, some of these little tart warmers. I have sweet pea, pineapple orchid, and warm vanilla sugar. These are kind of old. I don't really like them. I much prefer these little bricks. So these three are scentsy. I have Lotus Cove, uh, Cashmere, and Cerise, I think that's how you say it. And then I have a bunch from Walmart that I'm actually probably going to get rid of because I've had them for... A little while and they don't tend to burn as well as I like so that's what's in that drawer and then in this next drawer I have all of my lotions which again I try and weed out and downsize as much as I can I have three large body butters be enchanted secret wonderland and Japanese wait is that no pair some more and I really like those especially during the winter time I tend not to use them in the summer I have three baby ones I have a sweet pea back there a Twilight Woods and a Japanese Cherry Blossom. They sometimes have these on sale. I have the Aloha Pink Lotion that matches the perfume that I have. That bottle's kind of awkward. I don't really use it too often. I have my Love 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 Lotion, which I'm going to be busting out quite soon. Um, Japanese Cherry Blossom Triple Moisture Body Cream. Love that lotion. That's like my all-time lotion, all-time favorite type of lotion. I have a few extra pumps here. The Triple Moisture Lotion in, or the cream in Carried Away, Pink Chiffon, and Secret Wonderland. Top three scents by far. I have a bunch of these <laughs> travel lotions and the dollar lotions, so I'll go through them quickly. I have a Vanilla Teeny, um, a Pina, what is that? Scream a Colada from <laughs> uh, Halloween. I have Carried Away, Sweet Pea, Pink Chiffon, um, Bali Mango, Wild Apple Daffodil, Paris Nights, Charm Life, Pomegranate Citrus, Sweet on Paris, another Paris Nights, and then Paris some more. So, again, I have probably way more lotion than what I actually need, but like, uh, what can I say? I love Bath and Body Works. The next drawer is my home scents. I actually don't have as much as I normally do. I normally have a stockpile full of them. Um, but I've just been going through them quite quickly. I have two scent bugs. I have a bunch of these refill packs, these double refill packs. They go four deep. So I have Japanese Cherry Blossom, Cucumber Melon, Cranberry Woods. Back there is a S'mores, Winter Candy Apple. This is Twisted Peppermint, Pink Sangria, Caribbean Escape, Cherry Blossom. And then back there I have Kitchen Spice and Twilight Woods. And then here I have some random bulbs. Um... Some of them match, some of them are individual. I have some still that are good for the fall, like I have a couple leaves in there, some twilight woods. Then I have some extra of these wallflowers. That's what's in that drawer. And then this last drawer is my candle drawer. And so back there I have those turned over on their bottoms because they're Christmas scents. So the, they're going to be like, there's a gingerbread scent. I have my leaves and then a holly, something holly. And then all these are going to be like spring summer type scents. I have French Garden, Pineapple Orchid, Passion Flower, Paradise Daiquiri, Caribbean Escape, Marshmallow Peppermint, and Caribbean Salsa. And then I have a bunch of smaller candles here that are uh, the same scents. They're just tiny. Like these little, these little candles. So that's all the candles that I have here. 
And then the very bottom of this drawer is um, empty packages and stuff like that. I do have various candles around the house, like this one is uh, Caribbean Escape, one of my favorite scents for a candle. Um, I have various ones like in here, um, I have one in my bedroom, a couple downstairs, so I'm not including those because they're already being burned and whatnot. Okay, so this actually hasn't changed. This is the linen closet inside my bathroom, and I showed you guys this in my last Bath & Body Works haul. So it's kind of dark in here, so hopefully you guys can see. I have not the same things because I've rotated quite a bit, but on this side I keep my shower gels. So I only have two of the triple moisture shower creams left, which is pretty sad because those are my favorites. I have a bunch of these actual like jelly ones. Um, these are some soaps. I have just a few left of these jelly soaps. These aren't my all-time favorite. My favorite are definitely the foaming soaps. As you can see, I have entirely way too many. <laughs> There's probably 20 in there, and that's ridiculous. I still have some from Halloween and from Christmas, so I haven't bought any in a pretty long time, and I don't plan on buying any. And the reason I have so many of those is because I always have coupons that, like, you spend $10 and you get one of those for free. So, you know, I kind of stock up on them, but we go through them fairly quickly. I mentioned that to you guys in my was in my shower video. Yeah, so that is my Bath & Body Works haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, I have various products around the house. I have some lotions by my bed. I have a ton of stuff in my shower, which if you haven't seen what's in my shower, I'll post that video down below. Um, I have candles and I have stuff at work and we just have a bunch of Bath & Body Works stuff lying around the house but this is actually what I keep on hand as like backups and things like that so I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, yeah and I'll see you guys in my next one thanks for watching bye